Hey guys, Kenya Horton here, and in this video, I want to show you guys how I minimize my losses with Swipe Trades. So, Swipe Trades is a signal service offered by iMarkets Live, and top traders in our company will send you trade signals, and all you do is copy and paste the information into your MetaTrader 4 app, and you just let it do its thing. So, I love Swipe Trades, and I feel that the more knowledge that you have, whether if you want to just set it and forget it, you can. But if you are learning through the IML Academy and you're growing in your knowledge of Forex trading and you watch the swipe trades training over and over again, and the more you put in as many swipe trades as possible, you can do really extremely well with swipe trades. I've learned a few tips and tricks and I'm just going to show you really quickly what I do. So we got a trade notification on Euro USD, and this was the information. So so Euro USD is the currency. H1 is the time frame. H1 just simply means that it's called on the hour time frame. So when we look at the hour chart, the candlesticks read in one hour increments, okay? One hour increments of time. That tells us what the market is doing. I get a lot of questions about time frame. You don't have to worry about that when you're putting in a swipe trade. We had, it was a sell by market, which means that we got in through an instant, um, instant execution so had you gotten the trade alert like right away when swipe trades called it you will want to get in by sell, sell by market um instantly gets you into the market immediately if not they give you an entry price that you can use so you would go and look at your chart and maybe see how close price is to this entry price that they provide you with so we'll talk more about that in another video but basically what i did is i took this information and all you do is you copy it so you grab your entry price your stop loss and your take profit and you go back and forth to the MetaTrader 4 app and you enter it into your app. So I've gotten into this trade. One of the things that I do, I love to scalp and I also love intraday trading. So, but I love scalping swipe trades because the market pulls back a lot. So IML Academy teaches this, how to, how to trade pullbacks. And when you become skilled at that, or if it's something you want to do, you can really make quick profit. So in this, um, in this trade session, or I'll just say with this trade currency, like for example, I've gone to the gym this morning. I made like a quick uh, $30 really quickly just sitting at the lounge in my gym. We did have one loss this morning with swipe trades. So you'll see that in this particular account, this is my kids trading account that I trade on certain days. So I follow the growth comp plan. Um, many of you might be familiar with that, but let me just get to what I want to show you really quickly and I'll do more training on all the other topics. So I took the information and I copied and pasted. So when I can't, when I can't monitor the trade and swipe trade gives us the information, I do a really low lot size. Okay. I never risk more than one to 3% of my total account balance on any one trade. So if I'm going to do, for example, if I know that I have three, like a, if I want to use a $3 lot, I'm not going to put one trade in for just $3. I'm going to break it up and do maybe two trades or three trades and do a dollar lot size. So anyway, I scout swipe trades and I go in at different times when the market pulls back and I trade off of my support and resistance zones and I just watch closely what price is doing. So that's how I make quick profits from scalping. So I did this this morning and then we have two trades that are running right now. So what I do to make it a risk-free trade, like now that when I just see that I have a minute and anytime the trade is at least 10 pips in profit, all I do is I take my stop loss. So right now I have a 30 pip stop loss on Euro USD. Now that I see that this trade is 12 pips in profit because I'm trading at a dollar lot size. So now that I see that this trade is 12 pips in profit, all I'm going to do is hold down on the trade. I'm going to click modify. And, and my entry price was 1.5. 1.16850. So since it's a sale, I want to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this one pip past my entry. So that one pip will cover my commission charges if I get stopped out. And it also gets me out risk free. So what I mean by risk free is that if we look at Euro USD, so let me go to the chart. This is Euro USD right now. So let's say that price is here, right? You see my line that's moving? price is here and let's say it's continuing to go short but let's say for some reason something drastic happens we don't know nothing's guaranteed in the market so let's say it reverses and goes past my original entry let's say my entry is here and price suddenly comes here 
Well, instead, what's going to happen, instead of me risking 30 pips, now I'm only risking, it's, it's risk-free. I'm not, I'm not losing any money because I'm going to put it one pip past my entry price. And that way, if the market reverses, I can go and look and see what's going on and figure out why. Why did that happen? And I can figure out if I'd like to take another position and get back in, or I can determine my next entry or decision from there, okay? So what I do is I go, and if my, if my entry price is 1.16850, I simply just modify my trade, and I move it to 168850. So I want it to be 16840. So I would modify it, and I would put one six eight four zero and it's not letting me do that so let's see one six let's do once oh duh <laughs> that's why because i'm changing the wrong area so go here to your stop loss and one six eight four zero and you just click modify okay and what i can do is that as the trade moves more and more into profit i can keep moving my stop loss just following price. So I just keep like trailing it if I want to. Like I can move it five pips past my entry. And now I can just chill out. I can do my thing. I can relax at home, do whatever I need to do. And I know that I'm in a risk free trade. I've made a decent amount today, but to secure more profits, I can go ahead and trade risk free because I've already protected myself with a protective stop loss. And now my stop loss is past my entry. So if price reverses, it's going to get me out with a small very small profit and at least i won't have a loss so i hope this video makes sense for you if you guys have comments you can comment on the video and i'd be happy to answer them make sure you click subscribe to stay up to date on our trainings if you're not a customer and you want more information on swipe trades or you want to trade there's information in the description below otherwise thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next training